some people might see Scott Central as just a small, remote, uh, insignificant little school. However, I believe that our close-knit school is actually what's one of our most important attributes. It just blows my mind just how far our Scott Central has come from when I was here as a student and what it is now. It's a great place to be. Uh, I've always said we have great students, we have great teachers, we just have a great staff. We've got a lot of people that put in a lot of hard work. They, they want our facilities to look good. They want us, our campus to look good. We're trying to have one of the, the best looking campuses in the state. You feel welcome that every day you come and the teachers treat you like their own. All the kids are smiling when they come through the doors. All of them are smiling. Um, rarely do I ever see a kid in a bad mood because it's such a good environment. Every morning we have live video of our announcements. We have students from every grade level who come up and lead the Pledge of Allegiance. That live video is put up on Promethean boards all across the campus. And at the end of the announcements, every morning I say this, the challenge has been given, but the choice is yours. Choose today. Choose today. Choose today. Choose today. To exceed the challenge. You can feel the love that Scott Central has for the students. There's just no other explanation. They have good teachers, nice principals, good students. My teachers help me. The teachers and the faculty are all so nice and they treat you like your family. It's fun and I get to play with everybody. You get to meet new friends. We learn to do fun things. Um, we get to go to recess, and I play with my best friend, and his name is Hunter. The teachers and the administration always bring their best, and we know that we gotta bring our best if we expect for the kids to bring their best. Um, it's really important to be able to come to a school and want to be there and look forward to the next day to be with your kids and your coworkers. Our teachers are very, they're very data driven. They want to know where their students are today, where they were last month in comparison, and where they need to be a month down the road. We take the time to look at our goals. We talk about what a goal is, and we break that apart and see how to apply that in our lives in different areas. It's really just like what we need to reach this year, how we need to get to it, and also how you need to be disciplined and how you need to act. The teachers care about your academic future and success. What do you get to do whenever you make a 100 on I read? When I get a 100 on the iPad, I get to ring the bell. Um, what's something else you like about school? Um, doing homework so you can be smart. We have high expectations for all of our students to put forth an effort and grow as a learner. It's not just about meeting the standards. Yes, we want students to meet standards, but we also want there to be growth. They care about you and they take care of you and make sure you learn the stuff you need to learn. Like she teaches what she teaches multiplication. We learn division. She shows us how to do the, the right work. It's just uh, all the hard work and diligence that people put in as the teachers encourage us to do better in our classes. All the teachers help students focus on academics. It is very evident that our administration is working hard to give us the best learning opportunities available. 
There is a dual credit comp one and two. There's a college algebra and trig. We have been blessed this year to partner with the Central, also to offer an American History one, American History two, um, general psychology, as well as general music, AP computer science, and also AP physics one. It lets me better myself in my education and probably helps me in the future with college. Uh, we're a big sports school. Yeah, athletics make they make everything fun around here. You have something to look forward to, like after school, something to go to on Friday, like the football game, basketball game during the week. We have some of the best coaches there are. Uh, we have coaches that really push, push them uh, in all aspects of their sporting events. Uh, we, we've ha seen success in several different areas. We lean on each other. Uh, everything we do is a team effort. I believe football is kind of central and like we very good. Like, we 10 and 0 and we strive to get the ring. Uh, football pushed me to do all my work like, so I can get good grades. We created the Rebel Readers program in the last couple of years and that's where we have student athletes and they come down to our kindergarten through second grade classrooms and they interact with our students and read to them and talk about the importance of academics in athletics. Scott Central has numerous clubs and sports and activities. Our softball team, powerlifting. I feel like an Nevada club. Archery, venture. Dry um. Cross country, shooting sports. Educators rising, future business leaders of America. There's literally something for everyone here. I graduated here, and my grandmother graduated here, my papa graduated here, so it was only the right thing to do was to be part of this family first before I'm part of any other family. Both of my parents had went through the same school and graduated from the same school. My dad and my uncle used to go here. They used to play football here. We all connected We're like brothers and sisters. Well, at a small school, you feel like you know all the kids, even from outside of school. You go to church with a lot of them. You play ball or coach a good many of them. Like, this school has been very fun and great, and my teacher has always been there to help me. People treat you great at our school and you are loved. I like to encourage a lot of students. Like when I see people down, when I see people struggling with stuff, I like to bring in the help of hand. Everyone here is so encouraging and supportive of each other. We truly do love each other. Recently, one of our students, one of our teachers, and the grandparent of several of our students were all seriously injured in separate motor vehicle accidents. And there was and there continues to be a great outpouring of support and care for those uh, individuals financially through blood donations and in many other ways. And I think that's just um, a, a symbol of how we feel like we are all here, family, and we try to take care of each other. When one celebrates, we all celebrate with them. When one hurts, we all hurt with them and we rally around them and try to lift them up and, and to make that a little better experience for them. I can honestly say this is one of the best schools in the state. I've been in many schools and there's no place I'd rather be than right here. There's something about this place, it's, it's, it's just home.